everybody, I'm Blazing Rebecca, and welcome back to If My Heart Had Wings. Let's get on with this. It's for my... Wow! This is the classroom. The classrooms weren't exactly normal either, I can tell. I feel a little uneasy taking lessons here, but maybe I'll get you to it sometime soon. By the way, there's a girl in the wheelchair in school, right? Miss Alu... No, I mean, she's called Katori Haba. I asked Akia as we continue to return to our seats. I didn't ask what grade she was in, but even if it's not the same, I thought Akia would at least be aware of her. Ah! Uh. Mm. Akia reacted like she was being evasive. It wasn't just Akia, but other people saying yeah, but I heard our conversation also seemed kind of awkward. Habane-san nara uchi no klasu da yo. Kyo wa kite nai mitai da kedo. After Ikea said that, someone added, You mean today, either? Don't you? The way she said that seems quite harsh. That can't be, I mean. I thought about explaining that she had left the dorm tree this morning in a uniform, but I felt like tough. The atmosphere was kind of strange. Nothing feeling well. Yesterday she went out to Windmill Hill, and later she was chasing that duck around the halls of the dormitory. And this morning she left wearing her uniform. She's skipping school? However, more worrying than what Katora was up to is the reaction of the others in the class when they heard us talking about her. Even like Kia said, looked like she had something she wanted to say, but couldn't. I don't really know what the situation is, so I can't really say anything. Oi, Yamamoto! Oh my god. As the awkwardness started to fade, an optimistic voice called out. Ooh, is there gonna be another character, a guy here? When the entrance of the classroom, a carefree looking guy put his hand and started speaking to, to a boy in our class. Oh, it's a good place! Oi, Mama! Oh, another friend? That's right, huh? Nanka yoka? The guy known as Mabu came into the classroom. Oh my to Naka Yoko Steto, Eri chan no goki gen ga waruku nan da yo. Arete yappa jealousy te yatsu da yo na. I guess so, jealousy. Ii kara kochi koi. Ah. Oh, dare kore, tenkou sei? Ageha wa mitame kekkou kawaii kedo, nakami otoko da kara kiyotsukeru. Yeah, I'm aware of that, sir. I can't I'm about to look blankly at him for a moment. Na, nan. ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。ハ。
じゃねえよこの裏切り者マボさんにバトンに出してしまったのに Really? いきなり出て行ったと思ったらろくに連絡もよこさねえで、so. 俺やアゲハがどんな思いでいたかてめえ知ってるのかいやいや勝手に私を巻き添えにするな、yeah, そのくせよくもノコのこと裏切り者め俺は絶対許さないかんな well, now, suddenly, I don't like this much. お前なんか嫌いだバーカバーカ You're the one that's a moron! <笑> With lava flying out of his mouth as he emphasizes words, Mapo forgot all about borrowing the English dictionary and stormed out of the home classroom. Well, good, I'll make sure you fail, bitch! 子供かい Excuse me,、uh, shouldn't you be addressing that to him? It wasn't just us, but everyone in the classroom was shocked. こうなると思って教えてなかったんだけどね。知ってたらあいつ、最初から全開であんな感じだっただろうから。Well, I haven't either way. Congratulations. I think that was the correct decision. I want to, I want to say thank you. Even so, he didn't seem really upset about it. あいつ最近彼女ができて調子づいてんのよ。Oh my god, girlfriend. Well, we'll learn about more about that in the next part. See ya!